guys so welcome back to my channel today I am it's such a nice day like it's really really sunny I feel like spring is definitely on its way and um, obviously I'm not ready for the day at all so I just thought I'd give you an updated everyday makeup look because I haven't done this since my first ever video so if you want to watch that then just like scroll down to the bottom because it'll be there that was my first ever YouTube video but obviously that was almost a year ago so I thought I'd just do an updated one to be honest, a lot of the stuff I use, no, mm, no, it's not the same. There's only one thing probably that's the same, which I've used ever since, and I just use it every day because it's just the quickest and easiest thing to do. I am also going to time how long it takes me because I get a lot of requests for like quick makeup if you're like you're a busy mum or you're just really busy with work or just like you just need to do your makeup really quick and just make yourself look presentable and I think, I think that what I do is pretty quick, like I can usually do it really quick I think so I'm going to time it and see how long it takes me I guess it might take me a little bit longer because I'm talking but so don't like hate me if I'm like and now I'm going to use this and now I'm going to use this but I will try and I'll just do it how I normally do and see how long it takes me so I'm just going to get the stop, stop clock, stopwatch, stopwatch, um, yeah stopwatch up on my phone, all I've done so far, like I've got nothing on my face apart from moisturiser which I use the Bioderma one which looks like this, so that is what all I have on at the moment, so we're on zero, so I guess let's just get started, start, okay. So first of all, I apply some lip balm, which I use the Lucas Pawpaw Lip Balm. I would usually do that with my moisturiser, but I just thought I, I just didn't, I forgot, so. And then, what I've been using every day, which I absolutely love, is the L'Oreal Skin Perfection. This is the BB Cream 5-in-1 Instant Blemish Balm, and this is in medium. So it is a colour. It doesn't give, like, loads of coverage or anything, but I have seriously been loving it. So this is all I use, so I just dot that over my face. So I just dot that over my face, and then I use a stippling brush to blend it in. Um, I think just using a stippling brush gives you a really like, light, natural coverage. The only thing is, this is my MAC one, and I feel like the hairs keep coming out. But... So I just run that all over my face. I think this is the perfect like, you know sometimes if you want to just put foundation on it, it looks really odd. But to me, that just makes your face look better, but it doesn't look like I've got makeup on. Can you even tell it looks better? I don't know, but it does, trust me. So, and then with for concealer, I have been using my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in number 10. So I just pop this under my eyes. My eyes. A little lift. And then whatever's left on the brush, I just go down my nose, here and here. Tap it in with my finger. So I just use the stippling brush just to sort of blend that in. And then I do just set that with my Bare Minerals, the one I've been loving at the moment, which is the concealer powder in Well Rested, on a What It Needs setting brush. Okay, and then on a day to day basis, I don't do any like crazy contouring. I literally just use a large, <laughs> I just use a large fluffy brush and the bronze shade from the contour palette. I just run that under my cheekbones. I kind of in like a three shape, so it's going to put a bit of definition in your face, but it's nothing crazy.
See how easy was that? Like, super easy. And then I just go over, just to bronze up my face a tiny bit, I use my Bates Milani bronzer. Okay, and then blush I have been using at the moment. I change my blush all the time, but recently I've been going to my MAC Peaches. Same brush. One of those bloody hairs. And then highlight, I use my Mary Luminizer by The Balm with my finger. Whew. Okay, face is done. Eyebrows, Maybelline Brow Drama in Dark Brown. Okay, and for the eyes, this is the thing that I said I do use the same, which is the Barbara Daily Eyeshadow Stick in Bronze Gold. So I put this all over my eye. My eyeball, really messily, and underneath. <laughs> really messily. And then I take this Real Techniques, this is a duo fiber eye brush, and I just blend that out. Um, mascara, I curl my lashes. Mascara, I've gone back to my trusty L'Oreal Voluminous, just can't get enough of this one, and this is in Extra Black. While that coat of mascara is drying, I'll do my lips, so I'll just kind of get off any excess of that balm. Sometimes, if I'm literally like not doing anything really, I might just leave lip balm on, but if I was doing something, I would do lips. At the moment, I've been loving this Barbara Daily lip pencil in Nude Berry. So I just line my lips quite lightly. You can see, obviously, I kind of filled them in. So I do that. And then I'm loving this NYX. This is one of their soft matte lip creams. And this is in Stockholm. Stockholm. I'm so obsessed with matte lips at the moment. Okay, and then I curl my eyelashes again. Really bad, you really shouldn't do this. Like, it's meant to be really bad for your lashes, because obviously you kind, of, kind of stick and pull them out. If you do it carefully, it might have never happened. That's totally fine. And I'm just a bit of a rebel, so I'm gonna curl my lashes again. Also, because I've got quite short lashes, so I really need them to be curled. So I just curl them, but when you take them off, just make sure you like do it gently, but it just makes such a difference. So then I go in my second coat of mascara. Which obviously if you've got long lashes, you don't need to do this. And that is all, let's stop the clock. under 11 minutes that took can you see that okay it's not in focus but I think you can still just about read that it's 10 10 minutes 59 seconds point 13 hmm. 11 minutes basically that took me which I think is pretty good Um, obviously I would then get changed and my hair like every day I literally just take it down and 
This is my hair. <laughs> like, I don't wear extensions every day, like, at all. If I'm going out somewhere special, or it's the evening, or I've got like a nice lunch to go to, then I'll put extensions in, usually. But every day, I just wear my hair down. So just like this. So, I hope you liked this video on my everyday makeup look. I hope it was helpful if you are a busy mum and you just got stuff just busy, basically, and you just need to get your makeup done. <laughs> done! <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you liked this look and gave you some tips and just gave you a little bit of insight on what I do every day because obviously I don't wear loads of makeup every day. To be honest, a lot of days I don't wear any makeup at all. Like, if you're in Brighton, you will see me without makeup. A lot. <laughs> um, and I tend to live in gym clothes. <laughs> Hence this top. <laughs> um yeah okay i don't think i've got anything else left to say so i will see you next time bye guys